There are two main methods of winding a flower loom, the flat wrap and the layered wrap. The flat wrap creates flat flowers like this one. This one's made of paper. The layered wrap creates more three-dimensional flowers like this one. You can see here. The difference is most obvious when you're using bulky yarn or ribbon straw. In this video I'm going to show you how to do the flat wrap. I'm using a Studio 12 multi fleur loom and a DK weight yarn. Start by threading your yarn into one of the slots at the side of the loom or you can tape it underneath if you're worried about damaging it. To do the flat wrap go up to the top of your loom and around the pegs and back in a figure eight. Do that as many times as you want for your particular flower. If you want each petal to have three loops go around three times. I've gone around three times. Now move over to the next set of pegs. And this time when you come down, come down to the same side. So you're not crossing over like this, you're coming down to the same side. And go around those as many times as you like. And you can see you're now ready to go over to the next set of pegs. Keep doing that all the way around. And there I've gone all the way around. I like to stitch the center of my flowers with a different color. So once I've wound, I thread into a slot next to where I started. And just trim the yarn. I just leave enough to sew into the center on the back. I'll show you how to stitch the center of your flower in another video. I'm going to begin with videos on back stitch and stem stitch and you'll find links to those around about here.